Hey, what's up guys? It's Flex and welcome back. So a few weeks ago, I installed some 19 inch gloss black wheels on this C300 and it looks pretty good. Yes, I know I need to do something about the suspension. I'll do that in another video. But in this video, I wanna take care of the gray caliper. With everything I've done to the car and the new wheels, it just looks really old and tired. The one thing I don't really wanna do is paint them. At the end of the day, it's just really messy to do. It's time consuming. It flakes off in the future. And also if I plan on selling this car, I wanna make sure the calipers look OEM. So the best option to do that is to install some MGP caliper covers. And if you guys know in the past, I installed some red ones on the C300W204. I installed some yellow one on the C250 that I previously owned and they turned out great. So in this video, I wanna install two different types of custom caliper covers on this car. And you guys can determine which I should keep on the car. And I wanna thank MGP Caliper Covers for sponsoring this video. And if you want more information on caliper covers, use the link in the description below to go to MGP's website. MGP is a manufacturer and reseller for high quality caliper covers. We're talking about high grade aluminum, a unique patented mounting system. Their caliper covers can be customized in many different ways for many different vehicles. These caliper covers will help reduce brake dust and dissipate heat. And at the end of the day, they look really cool and they're fully reversible. So let me show you the custom caliper covers I picked up for this car. We're gonna go ahead and install them and then you guys decide which one I should keep. So here are the two custom caliper cover sets that I can't decide on. We have the carbon fiber style and we have the gloss white style. You have two for the front and two for the back and check this out. Look at that quality. And this is engraved in painted silver. And of course it's made of high grade aluminum. And check out this gloss white. This is also engraved in painted black. A really good quality. High grade aluminum. They both come with the instruction manual, the feeler gauge, and all the brackets and hardware to mount them to the car. The first step is to take the caliper cover and mount it flat against the stock caliper. Then take the bracket and slide it between the rotor and the stock caliper. Now I can install the two nuts. Also, I'm gonna to have to torque them down to 25 inch pounds. Now I can use the feeler gauge to make sure the bracket clears the rotor. And if it doesn't clear the rotor, I can use a screwdriver and pry up on the bracket. So I just finished mounting the wheel. Now there's a nice gap between the spoke and the caliper cover. I can focus on the back caliper covers. Same as the front, but now I'm gonna start first with the brackets. Now mount the caliper cover on the bracket. Install the two included nuts. Also, I'm gonna to have to torque them down to 25 inch pounds and then use the feeler gauge to make sure the bracket clears the rotor. And that's it for the install. So here we go, what do you guys think? So there you have it, the two styles are installed on the car. What do you think looks better, the carbon fiber style or the gloss white style? 
make sure you vote in the comment section below. I hope you guys liked the video. If you do, hit like below. As always, make sure you subscribe, and I will see you next time.